What up you guys? My name is Aline, they call me Aline, and welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I wanted to do an updated My Everyday Makeup Tutorial. I haven't done a video like this in a while, let alone a makeup tutorial, so I thought I would update you guys with like what kind of makeup I've been using on the daily lately. Just a little disclaimer, all the products that I show in this video are purchased on my own, which is why I'm still a bro former college graduate. Now let's get started and without further ado, let's dive right into the video. First we're going to prep my lips with the Burt's Bees Lip Balm. Now we're going to prep my face with the Thayer's Witch Hazel Toner in Rose Petal. Now I'm going to start moisturizing my face with the Ordinary Alpha Arbutin 2% plus HA. I'm also going to add another moisturizer slash sunscreen which is the Murad Oil Control Mattifier with SPF 15. Now I'm going to start priming my face with the Ordinary High Spreadability Fluid Primer. I'm going to apply another primer which is the Ordinary Zaliac Acid Suspension with 10%. I'm going to set my primer with the original RCMA No Color Powder. Now I'm going to apply my brows with a Precisely My Brow Pencil from Benefit in the shade 5. Now I'm just going to clean my brows with a small eyeliner brush. Next, I will be applying the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in the shade Tawny, which has an SPF of 20. Next, I will be using the Tarte Shape Tape Contour Concealer in the shade Medium, and just applying under my eyes, on my dark spots, and my little pimps, and blending it with a beauty blender. Next, I will be using the Catrice Cosmetics Liquid Camouflage High Coverage Concealer in the shade Light Beige to just brighten under my eyes and blending out with the Beauty Blender. Now, I will be taking the original RCMA No Color Powder to just bake all over my face. Now, to just wait around to have my face bake for 5 minutes. Now, I'm just going to use a brush and just wipe up all the excess baking powder. Now I'm just going to bronze my face with the Too Faced Bronzer in Dark Chocolate Soil or Soil, I don't know how to say it. <laughs> I will be taking the Becca Jaclyn Hill Collaboration Palette and using all three blushes and using them on my cheekbones. Now I'm going to apply some highlight and I'm going to use the Super Shock Cheek from Colourpop in the shade Dreamcatcher. I'm going to apply some more highlight by using the ColourPop I Like Your Face palette and using all the highlighters in the palette, mixing them and applying in my high cheekbones. Now I'm going to apply some eyeliner by using the Physician Formula Eye Booster in the shade Ultra Black. Now to give me some color again, I will be applying the Makeup Forever Pro Finish Powder Foundation in the shade 127. Now I will be setting my brows with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. Now I will be applying mascara with first curling my lashes with the Shiseido Eyelash Curler and using the L'Oreal Voluminous Miss Mango Rock Mascara. Now I will be applying my lipstick which I will be using the Colourpop Ultra Blotted Lip in the shade Zuma. Now I will be setting my face with the Morphe Prep and Set Makeup Setting Spray. And now that's the end of my makeup tutorial. So you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my updated My Everyday Makeup Tutorial. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, leave some love down below and of course subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. 
bangs are just so long and you guys probably see that I have white hair but you know that's a little another story if you guys don't follow me already follow me on my socials all my usernames uh, for my Twitter Instagram and snapchat are a lean to the and I want to say thank you guys again for watching until next time it's been real and I'll see you soon bye